today we talked about, we called her misinformed. So it's all talking about the bride's preconceptions that she will have of a vendor even before she walks in the door. And my theory on it was, yeah, ma'am, it's just about the facts. So I want to show you how to, to break down those walls and show them who you really are. So there are no preconceptions, only the facts. Well, I think one of the things that wedding providers, service providers have to do is you have to know what your own thing is, like what your original authenticity is, what your craft is. To be honest, you have to know your business because if you know your business and what it is you're supposed to do, you can basically blow out the water. Anything, any blog, website, television show, whatever may have to say because you're the one in the trenches and I need people to understand you're in the trench. You control this and that's what it's about. It's all about the art of control. No. As I said in my presentation, start how you want to finish. For a lot of people, the reason things go bad is because you didn't take the reins at the beginning. And it doesn't mean that you're overbearing. It doesn't mean that you're controlling. What it means is that you are indeed in the driver's seat. Because look, people don't know what they don't know. For the average person, they've never planned a wedding. They don't know what goes on, but you're the professional. You do. So it's your job to guide them and to counsel them. So if you want a really great wedding, take the reins from the beginning because it's like Maya Angelou said people tell you who they are when you first meet them so in that very first meeting everything you needed to know about that client they told you now whether or not you listen is a different story actually what we're seeing is what I call more personalized weddings so I'm watching the actual size of guest lists go down dramatically it has a lot to do with the economy too because I mean when you start wanting to have 300 people that's a lot of money and people are just getting back to you know what I only want the people who I really like and truth be told most of us only like that many people and those are the ones that you want to come to the wedding and it helps you to have the kind of intimate celebration you want and I think that's probably the biggest trend is smaller guest lists and great food everybody is really into food so it's like going to a restaurant no more rubber chicken no more peas rolling across the plate good food